Hello there and welcome to this Memphi tutorial on how to add your ETH Linear Network Wallet to Memphi and you know that you need the ETH in your Memphi account to be able to receive your airdrop that's going to serve as your gas fee and the airdrop is around the corner the listing and airdrop is around the corner so that's that's what has prompted the need to make this video and if this is your first time showing up i want to appreciate you so much thank you very much god bless you and for all the time subscribers merci beaucoup russia all right remember to subscribe like and share this video and also check in the description for a link to my telegram channel so you can join us on telegram all right you can still join me if you haven't check the link in the description so to add your ethereum wallet etf wallet you go to wallets and first off you need to understand that there are three wallets here you have your main file wallet i mean two wallets rather you have your main file wallet you have your eth wallet for the main file wallet if you tap there here you have your main file wallet and you need to here this is where you receive your main file right there you can withdraw when the time comes here you need to actually copy your open it and copy your your the secret pass that's the passphrase to save it we'll deal with that later on but let's go ahead and deal with the one that we are on right now which is the eth okay so uh, this is your where you want to do that so quickly you tap on eth here so you go to deposit now remember the eth you're going to be adding here is the linear network eth okay so you now you don't even need more than one dollar here because the, the gas fee they are going to take it shouldn't be more than a dollar so but just to be safe maybe one or two dollars you can send to this address so you just all you do is tap on deposit and then you copy the address but read the instructions first this is deposit eth linear the network is the eth linear network and then you are going to copy this address we have copied this but read the instruction it says make sure you deposit your tokens to the correct address and network and network is what linear in brackets so you can read the instructions on how to do that which is what i'm going to guide you through okay so next is go to your exchange that you use i am using bybit here so we're going to use bybit to demonstrate this so let my bybit open okay so my bybit has opened now so i go to wallet or rather assets rather on my bybit so it opens i now tap on deposit before i do that i need to convert my usdt to eth so first off i go to convert i tap on convert okay so here now you have what is showing me is usd but that's not what i want uh, i want to change the direction usdt so i'm going to select eth here so just scroll up this is eth okay so is there now so i'm going to type how much i want to enter so let me just put like um let me put two dollars all right so quote all right so uh, this is it confirm okay so that's done now i go back so we'll just go back here so what i will do now is to withdraw so i tap withdraw So I'm selecting ETH. Okay, so and the network, choose network. This is where I choose network. So I'm going to choose ETH linear. So select linear. So you can see these various networks that you have here. Scroll up and look for linear. This is linear. Okay, so here is it. Fees. You can see the fees 0.0002 ETH and i am sending 0 0.0007 so i'm going to send max so 
I'll be receiving 0.0005 ETH. Okay, so let's go and um, there's something I've not entered. I've not entered the address, so I will paste that address here. Okay. Okay, I think that's it. Next is to tap on withdraw. Okay, confirm. Uh, yep. Okay, so at this point, they are going to, uh, for security verification, I'll need to send a code to my, I'll get the code from my email and then also from my Google Authenticator. So what I do is here is tap on get code. All right, so it sends it. So I go to my mail. So I get the code, I put it there. So next is to get the one from my Google Authenticator. So I've imputed the code, so I now confirm. So you can see with our application submitted in process, please head to the asset page to check status, recommended security verification methods to enhance your account security, fund password. Anyway, so that just tap OK. I've moved the fund now. So what I now do is to go back to my, you can see that this has been removed. All right, if you go here, you can see that my asset balance has been removed, it has been deducted. So if I tap on this, you will see that the ETH is no longer here, it's gone. So I'll now go to my main file to check. So, so we are back here and you can see that the 1.47 now, you see that I sent everything, I entered $2 and 0.002 ETH was used for, uh, was used for the fee transaction fee and what I received there is 1.47 which is 0 0.0059248 you can see it here now so that's in simple terms how to add your ETH send ETH to your ETH linear network wallets here in Memphi this it will be here it will be used for gas fee not all of them will be used so when the time comes I'm going to make another video to record it. So if you have any challenges trying to do this, just let me know in the comments. It's as simple as that. So go ahead and do it and get ready for the Memphi airdrop. In another video, I'm going to explain to you how you can get your Memphi wallet address, passphrase stored safely. All right. If you got value, go ahead and like the video, share it, and of course, also subscribe if you are here to smash the notification bell to get to the first as I drop the next important video for you. And check in the description of this video for a link to join my Telegram channel. Thank you very much. I appreciate you so much. God bless you.